Hello everyone. Today is Friday, December 17th, 2021. U.S. announces two opportunities for Nigerian agribusiness to attend Go Food Show and Agribusiness Trade Mission in Dubai. This is taken from The Guardian. As part of efforts to support the food industry and agribusiness value chain in Nigeria, the Foreign Agriculture Service of the U.S. Mission in Nigeria is highlighting two opportunities for Nigerian agribusiness to attend Go Food Show 2022 from February 13th to 17th and Agribusiness Trade Mission in Dubai from February 16th to 21st hosted by the U.S. Department of Agriculture. The two agribusiness trade events will provide considerable opportunities to meet U.S. companies. The goal of the GoFood 2022 show and the trade mission is to increase two-way trade between the United States and other countries of the world. It also provides exhibiting countries, companies and visitors unparalleled opportunities to discover new markets creative new products, ideas, and innovations. Counselor for Agricultural Affairs, U.S. Mission Nigeria, Gerald Smith, explained that Nigerian buyers and importers will be able to meet with nearly 100 American exhibitors spanning food, pulses, and grains, meat, and poultry products. He explained that the Go Food Show and the Trade Mission will provide Nigerian participants the unique opportunity to meet and network, quote, one-on-one, -on -one, unquote, with some of the top decision-making food executives that are looking to meet and do business with international partners. Quote, the Foreign and Agricultural Service is ready to welcome Nigeria buyers to this opportunity to interact with high-quality U.S. exporters, unquote, Smith said. Part uh, quote, participants will discover new products and suppliers that stay up to date with the latest trends in the global food and beverage industry, unquote. Market prospects at the Go Food Show include dairy products, frozen poultry, chilled and frozen red meat, fresh fruit, snack foods, confectionery, packaged foods, dried fruit and tree nuts, potatoes, wine, beer, and fishery products. Go Food Show is reputed to be the largest American-focused food and beverage trade show in the Africa and Middle East region. Nigerian agribusiness companies interested in attending the Go Food Show and agribusiness trade mission must register in advance and pay their own way to participate. The thing I get from this is that uh, this uh, program is calling for Africans to import import food from the United States, maybe from other uh, Western countries as well, but uh, obviously primarily from the United States. And the types of uh, foods are dairy products, which Africa is more than able to produce enough of for the African continent, frozen poultry. There's no need for frozen poultry in Africa because there's enough land uh, to, uh, to have uh, chickens and, and to have a, uh, a fresh poultry industry uh, throughout Africa. Chilled and frozen red meat, same thing. Fresh fruit, same thing. Snack foods, not needed. I mean, it's, you should be able to produce it. In Africa, I, uh, when I lived in South Korea, I noticed that they were very clever. Anything that was able to be produced in the West, if they could produce it in Korea, they have their own company. So African nations need to, to learn that. Um, confectionery, packaged foods, dried fruit and tree, uh, tree nuts, potatoes, wine, beer, uh, South Africa has more than enough wine probably for, for the continent. Beer, there's, beer was invented in, in uh, Egypt, so Africa has enough beer. It doesn't need to get beer from anywhere else. Uh, fishery products, just don't let the Chinese and other 
countries come in and fish in your, your waters, Africa, and you'll have enough, your, your own uh, fishermen will be able to produce or catch enough fish for the whole continent. And, and might I add, keep uh, the Chinese from uh, uh, polluting your rivers and lakes uh, with their mining industries uh, so you can get fish from there as well.